we keep people out of litigation. And how do we do that? We put clauses in their contracts that help them so that if there is a dispute between the parties, that clause hopefully is in that contract because we thought about it before it happened. And that way we can point to that contract and say it's already been handled. We also put clauses called liquidation damages in their contracts. So if they ever do something wrong, their damages have already been reduced to a certain amount under that contract because we had that other party agree firsthand if there is a problem, this is the amount that they recover. It is so important, I can't tell you how important it is when you're in business to have a good standard contract that you can use that has a lot of bells and whistles for you. That can prevent you from getting into a mess because your contract has provisions in there that protect you. And having those provisions, if they take it to another attorney, they either will not be interested in the case or it will settle for such a small amount because of the precautions you did early on in the case. The other part is your clauses in your contract itself. We have venue clauses in there. We have a uh, waiver of jury trial sometimes. I love a jury, of course, if I'm representing, depending on who I'm representing, but it, it keeps the fees down if you do get into a dispute. So I try, and I put a mediation clause. Uh, Jerry, you're a wonderful mediator, but it's so important. 90, over 90%, of, and Jerry, correct me if I'm wrong, did 90% or more of the cases settle at mediation, General? So if you have a 90%, you can get rid of the case without trial. What makes attorney's fees so expensive is the trial, prepar preparing for trial, <coughs> because you have to put on a big show. You go to a mediator, the mediator is doing the opposite. The mediator is trying to pull you together. When you go to trial, it's the opposite. One party is trying to hammer everything they got on the other party. It is a war. So I put a mediation that you have to go to mediation. So those are the kind of clauses that really help you. And the other one that's really important, I love this one, is almost every contract we do that we, we tailor make, we put a liquidation clause in there. Because how do you determine the profits? How do you determine the damages? So what, for you, we would put, if we're liable in any manner whatsoever this contract, we agree that you've agreed that it's hard to determine the amount that was owed. So what we're gonna provide for you is one month's of service. And we've agreed that's a fair rate. So you know if you go into it and an attorney looks at it on the other side, they can't go get a year. They can't go get 100,000. They're limited to one month service, 5,000. Attorney's not gonna take the case. And they're gonna say, you signed it, you're stuck. So that's another thing we can do.